Hi, my name is Jerome Silver. I wanted to spend a few moments just sharing a little bit about myself. I am a family man. I've got four kids. Uh, uh, two are still in high school and uh, two are married and on their own. I, um, I love working with people. I spent the last 17 years of my life dedicating it to building charities, to doing work in parts of the world that, uh, that are less fortunate than us here in North America working with uh, building orphanages for young people, people without, uh, without resources, parents. Um, I love helping people. Recently, I've uh, decided to take stock of my life and work closely with uh, people to build a, a revenue source for themselves. Um, I will share a little bit more on that later, but I just want to, to just you know, tell you that um, <clears throat> it's so important in the world that we're living in today to reach out and help your fellow brother, your fellow sister, and that's what I've been doing. Right now I am uh, leading an organization here in, uh, in Toronto, um, the Malvern Rouge Valley Youth Services, where I'm working with kids in the community, uh, providing uh, opportunities for them to learn music, and uh, we've got a number of other things on, on the slate there. We've got a chess club and fun stuff like that. <clears throat> the first one I made is I'm a family man. I'm also very dedicated to seeing my kids grow up uh, in the best environment they possibly can, working with them and uh, building a, a, a legacy for them to help them carry whatever they gain from being uh, in my household into the community and uh, they tend to be with me in everything I do and uh, they seem to enjoy it, <laughs> which is kind of a, a fortunate thing considering uh, they're teenagers. Um, so that's a little bit about me. Now there are a number of business opportunities out there and I've worked with people who've researched the web to find opportunities or researched uh, their, uh, you know, who approached me on a number of, uh, of uh, opportunities and in this environment uh, where the economy is, is on a downturn this is the time I think where opportunities are uh, popping up left right and center of course you got to be careful you got to filter them I've done some work in filtering a number of them and I've, uh, I've been fairly successful in a few of them but as a, as a person who uh, have no problem in trying stuff I've, tried a few and seen them go south, and I've tried a few and seen successes. So my intent here in uh, introducing myself is to take a, a few moments over the next few weeks to share with uh, anybody who is interested in some of the things that I've learned in building a business. First thing I'm going to talk to you about uh, is what it is to set a goal and what it is to see those goals come to reality. I've put a number of goals in front of myself over the years. Um, for example, uh, 17 years ago, I had a goal, uh, two years before that, to go away to, uh, to a foreign land to uh, build an orphanage. I didn't see how that was going to happen in my natural resources, but I took a plan called 10 Steps to Accomplishing Any Goal That You Want and put it to task and uh, I managed to go to Senegal, West Africa and with the help and uh, the resources that uh, came my way I was able to uh, enjoy spending time with uh, a number of kids in Africa and helping to contribute to their lives. Um, there were a few other trips uh, subsequent to that that I will share a little bit more as we go through this series. So I hope you will uh, take the time and uh, tune into this uh, series um, that I will be presenting to you, coming to you from uh, Toronto, Canada. You can see my uh, city skyline of, uh, of the CN Tower uh, in the background here. And uh, we will spend some time developing these uh, 10 steps and making it available to you for free over the next five, six weeks. Thanks for tuning in and we'll be in touch with you very shortly.